on that line, right on that line. You stay on that line, Claudia. Right there on that line. Good job, good job. A little more passenger. Well done. This is a battles between the old generation versus new generation. Let's start with old generation. The Toyota Tundra will be available to order from July. The Japanese have prepared design changes and a 2.8 liter diesel engine with 204 HP and 500 Newton meters. At the front, the Tundra facelift will be equipped with a restyled grille, a modified spoiler and LED headlights. The Japanese have prepared LED taillights, but also alloy wheels painted in black with a diameter of 18 inches. The palette of colors for the body has been expanded and proposes the new shades Emotional Red 2, Dark Blue and Oxide Bronze. Inside, customers will discover a new central screen with a diagonal of 8 inches, an infotainment system compatible with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, automatic air conditioning, a button to start the engine, rear and front parking sensors, but also a JBL audio system with nine enclosures. The Toyota Tundra facelift will be available in single cab, extra cab and double cab versions. The Japanese will keep the Invincible top tier. It will be available on extra cab and double cab versions and offers special body elements, but also additional interior equipment. For the USA market, the range of engines will also include a new 2.8-liter diesel engine with 204 HP and 500 Newton meters. The engine will be available with both a 6-speed manual transmission and a 6-speed automatic transmission. Regardless of the transmission chosen, the Japanese will offer the all-wheel drive system. In addition, the engine can only be ordered on the extra cab and double cab versions. Acceleration from 0 to 100 km per hour takes place in 10 seconds, 2.8 seconds faster compared to the versions equipped with the 2.4-liter diesel engine, while the average combined consumption announced by the manufacturer is 7.8 liters, 100 km. Toyota also proposes a series of improvements to the steering system, but also to the suspensions, the pickup now promises a bit more comfort. In addition, on the 4x2 versions, the Japanese have introduced a new electronic control system to increase the performance of the Helix facelift in off-road. 2024 Toyota Tacoma revealed with 326 HP hybrid power, new off-road trim the Ford Ranger rival has a turbocharged hybrid engine and even more off-road prowess. Turbo and hybrid power The most interesting details are under the hood. Toyota offers four different outputs for the Tacoma starting with the base SR model. 
The entry point is a new turbocharged 2.4-liter 4-cylinder that lets out 228 horsepower and 243 pound-feet of torque when paired with the standard 8-speed automatic transmission. Buyers can move up from there to the State Route 5 and get a more powerful version of that same turbocharged engine producing 270 horsepower and 310 pound-feet. Better yet, that's with a 6-speed manual transmission with automatic rev matching, long live the stick. That same upgraded engine with the 8-speed automatic adds more oomph, bringing the output to 278 horsepower and 317 pound-feet. At the top of the range, the Tacoma offers an optional hybrid engine for the first time. Borrowing the iForce Max branding from the bigger Tundra, a 1.9 kWh battery back and 48 HP electric motor join the turbocharged 2.4-liter engine, bringing the total output to a hearty 326 horsepower and 465 pound-feet. That's nearly double the amount offered on the outgoing V6 model and second only in horsepower to the new 405 horse Ranger Raptor, but the Taco still has more torque. Rear wheel drive is still standard on trims like the SR and State Route 5, but now it comes with a limited slip differential. Four wheel drive models add an electronically controlled two speed transfer case with high and low range gearing as well as an upgraded active traction control system with a limited slip diff. Opt for the top of the line limited model with the hybrid iForce Max engine and that comes with full time four wheel drive with a center locking differential. The multi terrain select drive mode function now extends to 4WD high as well as 4WD low with three modes adjustable on the fly, mud, dirt, and sand. Toyota also says the crawl control function, basically cruise control for off-roading, is much quieter than it was last year and comes with five adjustable speeds. And to keep you comfier on the trail, Toyota developed an isodynamic performance seat that uses embedded shock absorbers to help dampen body movement and stabilize the head and neck of the driver. But for overlanding enthusiasts, Toyota introduces a new Trailhunter trim for 2024. It sheds the TRD Pro's Fox shocks for 2.5-inch forged monotube Old Man Emu shocks instead, designed by Australian-based ARB specifically for long-range off-road travel. There are new steel bumpers, more robust rear recovery points, enhanced rigidity for things like rooftop tents, and the choice of a 5- or 6-foot bed depending on your overlanding needs.